Hi, this here is the Watch 2R from OnePlus and well this won't be a long video because when it comes to internals as well as the screen this is basically exactly the same thing as the normal Watch 2. So by all means please have a look at my review of the normal Watch 2, link in the description as well, to get a little more in-depth thoughts on the performance and what to expect from the operating system and the watch itself. But just to quickly sum the actual performance part of the watch up, the Watch 2R runs two system chips. One is the Snapdragon W5 and the other is a low powered chip called BES2700. Here the Snapdragon chip handles the watch's Wear OS functionality that is indeed full and functional, whilst the BES2700 chip handles everything else, resulting in a battery life well over a week with low-ish use. With everything on, as in the always-on display, pulse, blood oxygen and sleep measuring etc, you get about 3 days before the watch needs to be charged, which is still good. The dual band GPS is also good and fast when it comes to positioning, the workout modes are many and the watch supports Bluetooth calls as well as normal notifications, showing settings and whatnots, just like the normal watch 2 did and does. So what's actually new then? Well, price and design basically. The watch 2R comes in two color variants, one grey and one green that I've tested here and they both look very stylish and kind of serious plus it feels really nice to wear. It is still a big watch though, just like the normal watch 2 at 46mm, so that has not changed. However, the watch 2R is made of aluminum instead of stainless steel, reducing the weight from 49 to 37 grams or 1.3 ounces without any strap attached. The glass on the Watch 2R also isn't as durable as the Sapphire one on the normal Watch 2, making the Watch 2R drop the MIL STD 810H certification, but apart from that, there really isn't any real differences. The IP rating is still 68 and the watch is still built for 580M pressure. So price then, well the normal watch 2 is sold for around 300 US dollars and the watch 2R comes in at roughly 230 dollars. So well, un unless you really, really love the design and want or need extra strong glass, I see very little reason to pick the normal Watch 2 in favor of the Watch 2R. That is actually a really nice and even more affordable full-featured Wear OS smartwatch than its predecessor was. Alright, those are my short thoughts on the OnePlus Watch 2R. Please share any of your thoughts or questions in the comments below and I'll do my best to answer them. Thank you for watching. Bye!